Yeah. Greetings, comrades. This is again Caleb back with another GZ Do mod video, and today we are playing Omerta. Now, simply put, this is a uh, game where you play as a gangster. You know, you're like 1930s, like a uh, New York Mafia kind of guy. And <laughs> that's pretty much the simplest description I can give it. So let me open up the Itch.io page. This is on Itch.io. And it's also on the ZDoom forums. But I have the Itch.io page here. So let me read it out for you real quick. <laughs> okay, so it wasn't too far. It's 1925. But yeah, 1925, a time where talk is cheap and bullets are cheaper. A time where many of promising gangsters would thrive and engrave themselves on American history. You are not one of them. You are Giovanni Joe D'Angelo, one of the many enforcers of one of these thriving organizations. All you've known your whole life was to lower your head and do your job. This time it's no different, hell invasion or not. Omerta is a mod inspired by Mafia, The Godfather, and uh, Guns, Gore, and Cannoli, GG and C, among others. About tough as nails, mob enforcers way to unleash pure vendetta upon hell itself. So yeah, you can expect some uh, weapons from that era, such as, you know, see a 1911 right here. And if I don't see a Tommy gun in this model, I'm going to be disappointed. But I see a few screenshots. There are definitely some uh, weapons they would expect from that era. Your typical sawed-off shotguns and pistols and stuff. There has to be a Tommy gun here. If you're playing as a gangster, there better be a Tommy gun. But yeah, this is a Bob Baby Lost for Words. I've actually covered a few of his uh, mods on this channel before. Like uh, I mentioned before, Disaster Jester, one of my favorite mods. You're playing as Harley Quinn. Also recently covered Final Raider, where you play as Lara Croft. And also covered a few other mods, like uh, a Raging Bull. And there was another mod that I forgot what it was. There's so many mods out there. And he also worked with another uh, mod called Mace. On a few mods, Raging Bull one, and there was another one, <laughs> another one that I haven't played yet. I didn't check that out. But he's worked on several other mods. He worked on Titanga. He worked on uh, uh, Outback Anarchy and uh, Red Spiral ninety three, among others. He has quite a few mods on his itch.io page. So I'll not only link the mod, the, the mod here in the description below. I also linked his uh, itch.io page. We can check out his other mods. He made quite a few. And he also did Final Raider Gold, which I'm going to show off later on. Anyway. Socio, Soldato, Capo, Consigliere, Soto Capo, and Padrino. So I don't speak Italian, so I'll just go with Soldato. I kind of just want to know, uh, like, uh, 1920s, 1930s style music. Got a little revolver here. Model 10. That's pretty punchy. Isn't a Model 10 like 38 special? Because last I checked, uh, Model 38, <laughs> Model 10's like a uh, Model like 38 special. I might be thinking about the wrong revolver, but I'm pretty sure it's a Model 10. Okay. Let's see if we're loading this mod here. And he must have extended mags on this 1911, because I own a 1911. They only hold seven rounds. Doesn't really look like an extended mag there. Okay, so we got some tonic. Okay. Dunright vest. Okay. I don't know if it's bulletproof, but I... Okay, I got pistol whip, okay. I've got dynamite, okay, that takes place at the rocket launcher. I guess this is mainly a weapon mod. Okay, so I got a... Oh, it's whiskey, okay. I guess it stores your health and stuff. So I got a bat. Kind of knocks him back a bit. Oh yeah, I gotta hit the switch. So we got 
Yeah, I'll just test that. Got a Molotov cocktail, hell yeah. This is expect some gangsters to use. And it's kind of small, but you could, it keeps track of what he's, how many secrets you found and stuff. Fucking A, yeah. Okay. Okay, we got a freaking bar. Hell yeah. Uh. So tight. Is that a car 98K? I can't tell. That's scorpion. We got a Tommy gun. Hell yeah. Complete with the 50 round drum mag. Got a sawed off shotgun. So this is a trench gun. Okay. I figured it'd be a trench gun. You can see the, the vented barrel. Okay, so... Hold on. Let me fix up my... Controls real quick. Okay, no. Yeah, next weapon, okay. Okay, so I got the 1911. Got a Model 10. That's a shotgun. Here's a sawed off. Death Toll Rises. Okay. Oh yeah, just as satisfying as you expect it to be. So I guess this is a chain gun. Okay, this is a rocket launcher. So I'm not sure why it's... Okay, so... It's pistols, shotguns, chain gun. This is apparently a rocket launcher, even though the dynamite is. So let's say this is a plasma gun. Only ten... five rounds. And this will be the BFG. The bar. Which makes sense, you've got to remember, this is like the 20s. Now, I don't know too much about gangsters and stuff, but I don't remember them using bars. I know they use a Tommy gun, obviously, and sawed off shotguns and stuff like that. But I don't recall them using bars. And for those uh, not, a, not familiar with guns or anything, BAR stands for Burning Automatic Rifle. It was sort of the uh, light machine gun for the U.S. Army. It was introduced during World War One, but it didn't really get used. It wasn't until World War Two that it saw more widespread use. And I believe the French Foreign Legion used this as well. Okay, let's see what the Soul Sphere is, or Mega Sphere. Gold chain. What was that to say? Uh, no nome do Padre, el de Figlio, el de los Spirito Santo. Amen. Okay. Is there no backpack? Okay. Got an ammo pouch. Okay, so this is, uh, I will say, it stays true to the era. You can remember, this is like the 20s. So naturally, they wouldn't have like uh, AK-47s or miniguns or anything like that. It definitely fits the era, I will say that. Barrels explode instantaneously here, jeez. But I'm so glad it's a Tommy gun. Oh, you can even spray and pray. As you would with a Tommy gun. It's a de the Valentine's Day Massacre. Got a recoil, though, but, you know, naturally it would. It's a... It's 45 ACP, and it's 
firing fully automatic, so naturally. There's gonna be some kick. Get those automatic reloads. Nice. We got a Seagar. That's why there's a Soul Sphere. Spoken Ace. Play your cards. So what does this do? This is supposed to be the partial visibility. Alright. Yeah, being invisible isn't going to save you from the mob. So I'm not sure what that pickup there is. Is that like quad damage or something? Okay, I didn't check out the dynamite yet, so let's do that. Glad trials in an arc. This is a gift for stealing from the mob. Okay, I've hurt myself, shit. So yeah, not a bad mob, not gonna lie. So yeah, if you ever wanna play uh, Doom as a, you know, a 1920s era mafioso, I think this is a mod for you. It, 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 in a way, it reminds me of Raging Bull, which makes sense from the same author. But, uh, it's a little more... calm. <laughs> if that makes any sense. Because you don't have that... You're not, you're not making one-liners or anything like that. You're just a mobster. You know, just killing anything that gets you in your way, so... <laughs> I can respect that. <laughs> but anyway, this is Omerta. Links in the description below, as well as a link to Lost for Words' is, uh, itch.io page where his other do mods. Check him out. And this is I'm Giving Caleb signing out. You all have a good day. Suck it up, life's tough. We know that. Someone's got better stuff and can throw cash. Tell them I don't give a fuck, make my own path. I don't need no handouts on my own man. Gotta get it, I'll get it, get it in fast, yeah. Got a girl and she'll get it, get it, she bet, yeah. Man, I only get down with the best, on. Uh. I'ma leave the complaints with the rest, uh.